Hey guys, we are back and once again we are with the Brio box. I believe this is a fall. If I'm wrong, I will change it below because um, I keep getting fall and winter mixed up, but I do believe this is a fall box. Uh, if you guys know, this is pretty much all the tech you didn't know you wanted or all the stuff you didn't know you wanted. Um, the Brio box has a seasonal subscription and annual subscription. I'll put the prices down below for you guys. So let's crack this box open and Yay. see what's in it. And as you can see, this is a true unboxing. As always, keep it still on. All right. Let's bust this bad boy. I think okay. it's rare that we look in ahead of time, but every yeah. now and then I can't help myself. <laughs> yeah, they always come in these big bags. Bagging. Use that for laundry or something. All right. Yeah. I try to reuse everything. Yes, yes. First thing first, we have a fresh e-tech therapy lamp. Yes, okay. A portable light therapy lamp that safely brings daylight indoors. The lamp emits natural sunlight by safely emitting a bright white light during the months of reduced sunlight. Uh, this is a UV free lamp simulates essential sunlight that keeps you happy and healthy. Plug anywhere and be happy. Um, this is mar valued at $59. As you guys know, during the winter, there's less sunlight, and it actually affects people's moods. Hmm. So this is something that people do for therapies, that they actually bring some form of sunlight into their house to get their mood back up. So, I'm sorry, huh? How do I use this? So you plug it in, and then you can adjust it for brightness. Uh-huh. Because it emits a white light with safe UV rays. And then you just kind of shine it in your direction and it's supposed to like stimulate you and make you feel better. So like emulate natural sunlight and right. Gotcha. But it doesn't take any, it's not the any real sunlight. It's, it's to imitate sunlight to help fight seasonal anxieties. Ah, right. So this is how people like get really, really sad and depressed. I like this. Yes. And if you are getting depressed, you guys, please seek mental health. There's a yeah. lot of different companies right now who are doing it for free, especially since everybody's at home. Uh, find a group, Zoom somebody, talk to somebody. For sure. There's a website called Scream Into the Void where you just type in things that make you mad and it just goes into nothing. But sometimes just screaming into the void helps. Scream into the void. You can't be pretty angry to do that. Well, I can't judge. <laughs> no, you just type in what you want to say, like, people suck, and it'll just, like, go away. Yeah. It's just the way to just let us promote some Yeah, them. definitely. I I agree. And I'm such a natural sunlight person. I actually, it's one of my requirements. Like when I move into certain apartments, there has to be a lot of natural sunlight for that reason. I wouldn't say it makes me depressed because I'm pretty chipper. Um, chipper and I let stuff roll off my back. I think I get that from maybe my mom. Maybe my dad too. They yeah. Both like that. They, both, they both pretty, what did that say? Just let it roll off your back, something like that. So yeah, but you know, whatever. I um, I'm big on natural sunlight. So this is, I'm interested to see if it really does emulate natural sunlight. So and I, I, we'll I gotta see you know. how it works with vitamin D because I have a vitamin D deficiency. So this gonna me too. My vitamin That's D. actually a lot of um, African American people have a vitamin D deficiency. It's just yeah, it's the thing. Um, a lot of people in general, but my doctor told me um, African Americans especially. Keep it moving. This is the wash your hands citrus scented foaming soap. Ew. So a foaming soap Ew, that comes in a tall, slim bottle uh, for easy carrying. I wouldn't say your tall. Back... <laughs> I wouldn't say it's tall, but okay. Slide into your backpack, purse, or luggage, and you will never be without a way to wash your hands. Also, trip wipes proprietary scent, uh, citrus scent. Will have your hands smelling like a dozen freshly peeled. Mmm. Very orangey. Clementines. Clementines. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And this is valued at eight dollars. This is on um, cruelty free okay. and a whole bunch of other stuff. In this yeah, place. cruelty free and plant based. Because that is important. If yes. you had to 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 treat something with cruelty, <laughs> that I don't want. It. Even though I'm probably still using it, don't know, but you know, I don't be know. All right, this is the um, Tribal Toothbrush Go Brush. Is it electronic? Uh, so the 
The Toilet Tree Go Brush is a travel, travel toothbrush that you've been waiting for. This sturdy travel toothbrush uh, easily pops open and closes with convenience for each use. With well ventilated holes and silicone cover, you can rest assured that your Go Brush, Go, I'm sorry, Go Brush remains clean, dry, and germ free. Uh, soft bristle silicone body uh, valued at $18. So that's how it works. At the bottom, it's twisty, it's spring loaded. Um, Here comes the home. Oh, soft bristles. I guess they chose black so that it could be for men or women. Mm -hmm. Got a nice little top, too. Uh, do I have and to then, twist it down and get it in? Yeah, we had to kind of figure out how to get it to pop out. Now we're trying to figure out how to get it to uh, go back in. Okay, so she's got it in. Hopefully, you guys get it in. <laughs> I'm going to let that joke go. I'm going to be the adult in the situation. <laughs> okay. So I guess so you have to carry it because I put mine in like a plastic baggie every time I go someplace. And yeah. It can get a little funky. We'll, we'll let her get that together. Again, it's just the go brush. You can just put that back in. And uh, see, it's me this time. She usually gets me about putting the stuff back in to the box. But, um... Next up, we have the Yeti um, Rambler mug. Um, crafted with detail, the Yeti Rambler does not only keep your hot contents hot and cold contents cold. The mug, no sweat design, makes constant condensation a thing of the past. To top it off, regardless of the internal temperature of the mug, the outside of the mug will remain comfortable to hold. It's valued at $25. It is dishwasher safe, both the mug and the lid. And it is uh, kitchen grade stainless steel, double wall vacuum insulation. So, and this is like a plastic, hard, hard, hard plastic. One of them plastics that feel like hmm, kind of so glass. This is my mug that I drink out of today. So you can see it's a decent sized mug. Yeah, I like this. And it has a little mouth slit. Can you see it? Yeah. Just enough to burn your tongue. That's all in one second. And go, oh, day. Okay. <laughs> Woo. Ooh. So, you all got the tiny burn. Tiny burn. That's nice. There's a lot of stuff in this box. All right. So now this is the uh, the OXO or OXO Good Grips Punctual Egg Timer with, with Piercer. Oh. Yes. Okay. So your kitchen assistant to help you uh, make perfectly boiled eggs. With seven doneness levels and egg size selector, you can easily find the setting that is right for you. Uh, the progress bar tracks, keeps track and alerts you when the egg is ready and you're uh, at your desired setting. Um, get ready to have the best eggs for at your brunch. Uh, buy you the $20 precise timing to help you cook perfect eggs. Pierce the locks it in place. Uh, so to use this, you select your desired doneness and egg size uh, using the turn knob uh, at the top and size indicator behind it with the wide side of your egg, pierce a hole, and voila, easy peeling uh, after cooking. So it cooks the whole freaking egg to the way you desire. So if you like the middle a little soft, you put it in there, you have it. See, my only thing is... You know, if you cook often or bake, which you do, and I do, um, I feel like one, you can only do one egg at a time. That's going to be pretty annoying. <laughs> that part. Yeah. Like, me, I'm thinking about, ooh, uh, deviled eggs, and this is going to be super annoying, just one at a time. But it's a cute little idea, and um, if you do just want one egg, and you want to cook it a, a certain way, it is... Eggs are one of those things you got to get right, like, five minutes boiling is going to look different than six minutes boiling is going to be different than seven minutes boiling, so. I tried the whole spinning technique. It didn't work for me. I just always want mine the same way, so I never have to consider it any less or more cooked, um, but this is great if you do. All right. Just scrambling. 
Um, uh, this is also the same brand, the OXO Good Grips. This is a sweep and swipe laptop cleaner. All right. Okay. Um, embarrassing fingerprints and leftover keyboard snacks is are things of the past with this portable multifunction device. One side of the soft bristles to sweep away any dust and crumbs on your keyboard. The other is a microfiber pad specifically shaped to uh, reach the corners and clean fingerprints. Uh, value at $10. Um, with a lot of people working from home right now, you guys are eating at your desk. I know I can hear you on Teams and Zoom and Slack and, and um, Skype. We it's hear me. you. We know you're doing it. Okay? Slurping, chewing, we, we hear it all. Um, but like you said, then you have your kids at home touching on your screen. This will help clean everything. You gotta press down then, because I was wondering why I wouldn't go. That's good. It won't just be all sliding up when you're trying to swipe. So press in, and then there you go. So I'm definitely ready to use that. Yeah. Cool. That's that. Um, how many more things we got just to give you guys? Two more things. <clears throat> Next up is the toiletries brand. Get organized. This is a hook tile. Hold strongly, removes cleaning. So I guess you can just hook and stick this anywhere. In. So the silicone bathroom hook holds up to four pounds alongside um, from being uh, rust free, it's 100% waterproof, waterproof. This heavy duty hook not only holds with confidence, but it's also removable and reusable. Go ahead, organize your shower and, and reorganize as often as you please. The silicone hook is there for your storage needs. Um, this is valued at $9, um, eco-friendly, reusable, uh, silicone body, stainless steel hook. Now, they are advertising you using this with a product they came with before in another box. This was the um, rubber scrubber, which is a little weird to use at first, but I did use a couple times. Um, and I guess after a while, it didn't stick anymore. So, you can put it on this now so it stays. Hmm. So, that was cute. About that, mine don't stick anymore. Probably it's not to throw it away. Yeah. Well, this is the very last item in the box, guys. This is the Smart Lock. Okay? This is not your ordinary padlock. The Smart Lock is revolutionary biometric padlock that unlocks using your fingerprint or smartphone. Uh, for convenience and increased safety, the Smart Lock can store numerous fingerprints um, so you can choose specific people you want to have access. Uh, now, please understand you have to download an app for this to work. Um, you can either go to Google Play or the App Store. Um, has Bluetooth connectivity, a fingerprint reader, rechargeable, um, anti-erosion, theft-proof, waterproof, and valued at $69. Now, I remember somebody, because this is one of the things they did a sneak peek on. And so one person was like, do they save your biometrics? I don't know the answer to that question. Because uh, a lot of people worry about them storing your biometrics someplace. I mean, it must. If it can open. Well, they're saying, do they save your fingerprint on a server someplace without you saying, please, it's okay for you to save my fingerprint in some server and not just between your phone uh, hard drive? Does it go to another server or someplace else? Does iPhone? I don't know. I think they all do. But what do I know? All right, so that is that. I think that's really cool. I don't know what I would want to lock. Well, this is something I would give like a teenager in high school to have a locker. But the problem mm -hmm. is that no one's in class right now. Yeah, and they give you locker. They assign you. And I don't think you can locks. legally put another lock on there without the school permission or something. I know yeah. PG County, the county we grew up in was like that. Like you had to use their lock. So that way yeah. they would have it. And you, you had, had to pay for it. You, you got, we didn't have to pay for it, but I went to a different high school than you. Yeah. Now, I know you had to, like, you got the locker, and it, your locker your lock was assigned to you. Oh, you know what it was? Was that if you didn't pay, say you didn't return one of your books from the last year that you were in school, then you owed for that textbook, and they wouldn't give you a lock for your locker if you didn't pay your previous dues. <laughs> So now you get your books, your next so, set of books stolen. So got out. No, yeah. it wasn't. <laughs> but, but um, yeah, but ours they gave you a specific lock 
Mm-hmm. Your lock belonged to you. You had to return your lock. If not, they would hold your grades. Yeah. And that and also they could open your lock because they had the combination for your lock. So if they ever want to go through your locker, they can go through it at any time. Because it was school property. It was not yours. Yeah. And they let that be known. You got a calculator? Uh, I do not. I can, phone. Maybe I can do it in my head. With your phone? In the room. Oh, I thought you still had it out here. Oh. Oh, it is out here. I was like, I brought it out here. I Okay, thanks for remembering. I do have a calculator. All right, we're ready. So first is our smart smart lock. The smart lock is sixty nine dollars. The light therapy lamp is fifty nine dollars. The mug was twenty five dollars. The sweeper was ten dollars. The egg timer was twenty dollars. The uh, bathroom hook was nine dollars. The toothbrush was eighteen dollars. Uh, the washer hands was eight dollars. How much did that come to? Two hundred and eighteen dollars. Okay, so two hundred eighteen dollars. I believe this box is valued at one fifty nine. Hmm. Um, so two hundred eighteen. Um, this is not one of my favorite boxes, you guys, and I usually love love Brio box. Yes, it's my least favorite for sure. Yeah, like I like the light. I think the light was cool. The egg timer, like she said, I'm only going to be able to cook one egg at a time. Maybe it was like four. It would have been worth it. Um, The toiletries hook, I got to see if I'm even going to use it. Ooh, yeah. Like I said, I probably need to throw that thing away that's no longer sticky. This the mug, cool. I'm going to use the mug for my coffee in the morning. Yeah. The fact that it will keep things hot. And not get too warm on my hands. We're gonna see because sometimes I like being able to put my mug around my hands and it be, get a little warm and toasty for my fingertips. So we're gonna see how that works out. Um, mm-hmm. The swiper, soap, the soap, soap, yeah. soap, soap. Um, it's cool. It smells really good, really orangey. Yeah. So this is like I said, something you can keep in your purse. Cruelty free. Um, the sweep thing I'm definitely gonna use. I do like that. Uh, I have things that are separate, but I don't have nothing that's together. The fact that having these together is great. Um, so that I like. Um, the light therapy, uh, I'm probably going to be giving that to Leslie. Oh, Leslie. Oh. Yeah. Because, y'all, it's so important for me to have natural fine. I'm going to update you on the next box. Thank you. Yes. So let you know how this works. Again, this Im- imitates the natural sunlight and helps fight seasonal anxiety. I'm, I'm really interested to see if the, if the light is natural, so I'm definitely going to let you know. Yeah. And um, the toothbrush, I mean, a toothbrush is a toothbrush. Yeah. I mean, it. after a while, this is going to get grimy, you too. Yeah, yeah, that's going to get grimy, too. Regardless of what you do, you can't get all the toothpaste off a toothbrush because it gets all into the grooves and the cracks, and you really can't get rid of it. So eventually, it's all going to get grimy. It's all going to get gross, so you're going to have to replace it. Yeah. You're just paying for the convenience of being able to push it down and put a cap on it. Besides going to CVS and getting the toothbrush that you just flip over, that's like $3. Yeah. That. That's the thing about boxes. I want cool things that I can just get out of the store for five dollars and you're selling it to me for thirty or whatever. Yeah. So I I think the only thing that I would have actually wanted out of this box is the the um the natural sunlight imitator thingy and then the mug. Nothing else. And the mug is like blah, maybe, maybe you know, whatever. I'm good with the without it. Everything else I don't really care. Yeah, about so Brielle box this this time you guys didn't hit the mark. You yeah. did do pretty good. Last time she didn't like the last box either, so you hit this the over. <laughs> yeah, so you hit the you hit the you hit the mark twice with her. Uh, this is time you missed me, guys too. So maybe next time would be better. Let us know what you guys think. Maybe we're just being really harsh. Yeah, to each his own. Yeah. <laughs> In life, there's black and white, but with us, you always get a shade of gray. Bye, guys.